Okay, so today's Saturday, uh, the 16th, I believe. This is the state of the 56 Pontiac Chieftain. Uh, I work uh, thirds right now on our flop. I decided I wanted to stay up this morning, so I decided to come out and mess around, made a heck of a mess, and decided I wanted to see if I could get the paint cleaned up and what it would look like. And uh, she's really looking beautiful. You can see, have you seen any of my other videos? There were pictures that I've posted. Um, what the original state was, what the car looked like. As you can see, it's surface rust and cracked paint and uh, stuff like that all over it. But uh, you know, she's taking a while. I did a few different things to see what I could uh, maybe uh, get it off the best with. Uh, believe it or not, what I'm using is uh, salt and white vinegar. Right now, with a Scotch Brite pad, I I did wind up cheating and um, put it on my drill and made my own little things to uh, make it come a little quicker. And I'm not using a regular car polish or uh, clay bar in it or anything like that. Once I get it good and clean, I all I've been doing right now is uh, washing it off with some glass cleaner or uh and then uh i go back over it that's not glass cleaner that's a uh, mean green clean it and then i've been hitting it with just some uh i don't know if you can see that but it's a white diamond metal polish and uh i got a little milwaukee buffer that i've been using taking my time and uh, I don't know, you can see, uh, nice and dirty. But anyway, uh, she's actually coming along pretty well. I love that patina look. I mean, it's just, it's just gorgeous. I like that I can bring back, you know, the original paint that was there. And she's even got a shine to her. I haven't finished any of that. That's where uh, I'm actually quit right now because uh, I ran out of my vinegar and salt and don't have any. I'm wanting to try on some of it, the CLR and the Scotch-Brite and see what I can get. But that's where we're at. Like I said, other than I've got a mess that I need to clean up and uh, I think I'm going to go in for some lunch. But no, I just wanted to share that with... Uh, you guys, uh, where I've got on it so far, what it's looking like. I'm kind of messing around a little bit here and there. The engine runs. Um, working on a, a master cylinder. I got some uh, nasty cold water leaks from uh, the hoses that are on it. Yeah, that I've uh, trying to get uh, fixed. I'm just going to put some new hoses on it and probably clean up the fittings where they uh, mount on it. Uh, transmission turns but it only goes in reverse i haven't figured that out yet um i'm trying to still figure that out because it's got the four speed automatic in it um at some point it, it was my original plan and then i started playing with paint but i still need to get in here i want to clean get everything out of the floorboards uh, the dirt and whatnot in it go through it and then clean it up i'll uh get it all washed down and see what everything's still looking like in here and uh but yeah that's where i'm at uh i'm gonna take a break for the rest of the day and probably do some more research and see what i can find um and go from there but uh thanks for watching hope you like how she's coming along and uh tell me what you think